Hello everyone, we are back with the Hogwarts Legacy, carrying on where we left off in the last video. We got to speak to Professor Fig, and I'm kind of looking forward to doing these classes. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? Uh, yes. Uh, I didn't... Uh, I didn't like to lie to her. I did try to evade her questions, though I feel a little deceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. I mean, sure. Yeah, you can check available quests. Um, uh, this represents main quest. Completing main quest will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Nice. Uh, some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be uh, you need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. Now spells can be earned by completing professor assignments or as quest rewards. Cool. Wait, where is where is my mouse gone? I have no idea where my mouse is. Here it is. <laughs> Here it is. Um, track the quest. Uh. Does it matter which one? Leviosa? Oh, cool. Oh, just any quest? Um, let's do... Oh, Accio could come in handy. Let's do Accio. Um, let's track that one. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. Yeah. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay. 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 Thank you. I still don't know what to do with this. Um, cast uh, Charmed Compass. Oh, okay, it tells us where to go. Uh, we'll lead you Rebellion. to anything you're tracking. Cool. Through here, apparently. Oh, it's so cool out here. Oh, I like it. Can I do anything with this? Oh, this looks so cool. I kind of do really wish that we could- Oh, hello! <laughs> I wish that we could kind of go in first person. Or the look was maybe a little bit different. I don't know if we can go into first person. Oh, hello. Oh wait, that's just him, sorry. <laughs> uh, defense against the Dark Arts Tower. Ooh, nice. Okay, cool, so I've we've discovered said this. That travel broadens the mind. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what these are. Maybe they are for different things. Oh my gosh, I love that. Look at them, they're just like looking at you. What do you want? <laughs> like hitting Hello. him. <gasps> Kitty! Hello. You know, my cat. I think I would like an owl, honestly. 
Good kitty. And then you just like Avada. <laughs> Sorry. I'm too into this. Um, we're going upstairs, aren't we? Are we going upstairs more? We are, but I want to have a Because there's like the room of requirements and everything. Oh, hello, bathroom. Is there another chest in the bathroom? Can we use them? Oh my god, is my- Oh my gosh! The polyjuice potion! Wait, was that what this is? Oh, I love if that's what this is. Can we go into first person mode? Okay, I don't believe that there is a first person. That is so cool. I do think that that is supposed to be the polyjuice potion. I was hoping we could come across like Moaning Myrtle. <laughs> I'm Moaning Myrtle. Oh, we can actually flush them. I don't know if she would actually be dead yet. That sounds really mean, but I don't know if that stuff would have taken place yet or not. <laughs> Ew. Okay. That is so cool though. I like that. Um, okay, sorry. There's a troll in the dungeon. I'm gonna I wanna watch Harry Potter now, cool. I'm probably gonna be so weird throughout this whole Professor Roland has to go on this. Some of us don't necessarily mark. want him to if get I back had to, to the lesson. If professor to race against, it'd be heckered. I'm serious. She's a thousand okay. years old. Um. Okay. So we can begin quests like this. Cool. I need to learn new spells. Need to make friends. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe we'll just be a lone wolf throughout here. this whole game. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with the passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Oh gosh, here we go, okay. <laughs> Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so... What better than a bit of sport to 
put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> This is a lot of effort, right? <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Okay, Very well, simply, do... cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last. Excellent. Stay oh, okay. focused. Do I have to like let go of it? That's it! Not to worry. Very good! Don't lose your composure! Very good. Points to Hufflepuff. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay. Watch this. So how do you... Wait. Payrolls. Okay, I think I do have to press it again. Splendid! Let us see this. Don't knock me off, I swear. There we go. Come on! Yeah, Fiddy. Quite impressive. Here we go! Yes! Oh no, it's gonna go off. Ah, oh, shit! It happens to the best of us. That was rigged. That was so rigged. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh, really? Cool. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. <laughs> I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Watch this. That is how it's done. You are not making this easy for me, are you? Let us see this. Whatever I do this time, I'm gonna win. Sweet, that'll do. <laughs> well done. Yay! Okay, that's cool. Like little mini games for learning the spells. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Um, 
I'm holding my own. Um, should we be nice? That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Um, magic, let's just leave well, it's it. it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Okay, cool. So it looks like of we course. have made ourselves you a friend. If you would. Humans, if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. <laughs> Sebastian, sorry. <laughs> you wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. That does not sound good. Is that an Iron Maiden first class student? Awesome. I believe that's what these things are called. I could speak to this person. I'm going Professor to. Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. You remind me of Harry Potter. <laughs> After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. <laughs> I think that's why I'm going to be like, honestly. Revelio. Um, okay, You're the new so student, aren't you? I am. Leave me alone. Uh, we have to. Uh, side quests are now available. Uh, available side quests can be found inside regions of Hogwarts marked as. Um, okay, and discover by exploring the world. Um, reward XP, but do not advance the main story. Okay, so here's a side quest here. Is that a side quest? I mean, maybe. Um, let's track this one. But I'm gonna speak to this person here. Hello, you wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale, I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Um, that's kind of you to say. It wasn't no challenging, uh, kind of you. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Was that a stab? Okay, so maybe we've made two friends already? Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Rebellion. Oh my gosh. Rebellion of and by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flack. Ooh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack! Was the Minister a Boot or the Minister a Flack? Stop it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a smack. She says it's a Boot and he says it's a Flack. Peeves, enough! You'll get us all detention. And you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> I don't know if there's like something you're supposed to do like this. Maybe it's supposed Rebellion. to reveal the answer, but honestly. Oh wait, there's one there as well. Uh, okay, so this one's level locked. 
there's two question marks there and one question mark here. Okay, I don't know. Unless these have like numbers on them. Narrow? Okay, anyway, sorry. I'm gonna leave that before I get like far too sidetracked. Um, and we have to go to our next class, which is the dark uh, arts class. So let's head on over to there. I feel like I'm just gonna like run everywhere. I love that the paintings are moving, apart from this one. Cute little dog. Maybe it's a animagus. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. <laughs> okay, so this is the dark arts one. Let's go! Everyone, oh my gosh, cool! Is that all you've got? Yeah. Oh, so. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. That is the dragon that attacked to us, To the I'm wise, sure. age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! <laughs> a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now. Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Surely she'd like correct her back, like her posture if you're magic. I mean, I would. I'm sure there's a spell for it. Okay, um, this one's gonna be rough. Levioso. Ring down, Larios. Ring down. <laughs> Ring down, Larios. It's a big O song. Now, the let's song. try something a little larger. Sorry. Sweet. Let us begin with a basic cast. See this, I can move my camera and I really wish I could. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, well done. Hey ah, cool. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. I'm gonna kill him because he's from Slytherin. <laughs> He's like off the table. <laughs> Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> Have you made a slivering friend? <laughs> I put you on the spot and you rose to the challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. Thank you, Professor Heckert. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. 
A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with your cape? Your cape is... I mean, maybe it's a fashion statement. You never know. <laughs> nice work. Thanks, Sebastian. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Uh, I've had my share of wand combat. It was. Never used my wand in combat. Um, I mean, let's not give too much away, eh? In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Um, <laughs> sounds suspicious. Unsanctioned? I don't know. School rules are in place for a reason. Yes, to keep students in the dark. So many things we're deemed unprepared to know. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck, or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Okay, cool. Till next time. Um, his hair is just like two different colors. Cool. So, quest complete defense against the dark arts. Wow. Oh, we can't lift up the teacher. <laughs> no? Okay. Can I have a look in her office? Oh, no, it's level locked. Rebellion. Okie dokes. Um. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that this was like the dragon that attacked us. Let us go then to um, quests. What do we have? So, uh, talk to Lucan. Okay, so this one is a main quest. Meet Professor Weezy. Oh yeah, we have to meet her and then we have to go to Hogsmeade. Um, should I track this one? Maybe. And then we'll go to Hogsmeade. So is it down here? Um, what was it? To... Oh yeah, it was this, wasn't it? I really can't wait to get like a broom or something. I'm going to speak to these guys because I'd like to get in on this dark arts thing. Oh, that's level. <laughs> Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice your mole? At uh, haunted toilets. Uh, Unless in dire strain, it should probably be best avoid. Okay. As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. These peas will make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed as did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. Rebellion. It was granted my privileges, be handsome indeed. Or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. 
to draw up a contract with her, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swim. Oh my gosh. I'll get you for this. Okay, is there gonna be another one? Is there gonna be like another like polyjuice potion in here? I mean, oh no, but there's freaking cake in this one. Dude, someone's making this their little like snack den. Why in the toilet though? And like why? I really want to see the one that has Rebellion. like where Moaning Myrtle was. I don't know if it would still be in here. My guess is that it would be right. Oh, piece of paper. Wait. What is this? So I can't seem to do anything with this yet. Oh wait, no I can, so... Uh, map, okay. Sorry, there's so much. I'm gonna get so incredibly sidetracked. <laughs> so incredibly sidetracked. Let's try and just go for this though. So, oh cool, I got um, some goggles. Glad you can make it. Lucan's just over there. Oh sweet. So what do I do with this? Oh, it's got one of those symbols on it. Oh, okay. Bavelio. Oh my gosh, we're literally in the clock tower. Okie dokes. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Uh, that's nice to hear. I did take him down a peg. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Yeah, I want to know what the prize is. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Um, sure. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! He sounds like a Hugo. Oh, we'll make fail. you regret signing up. <laughs> Sorry. Um, okay. Breakthrough, yellow shields with control spells like uh, levitating spells, Leviosa. Um, okay. Target locked. Uh, let's attract enemies without aiming. Use to change targets while well, locked. Dude, okay. There goes the ranger. Is that all you've got? Bring up. You're better than that. Descend up. Okay, cool. My health I is a bit down. That. <laughs> nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. What about my prize? Hope to see you back here again. Where is my prize? Okay, Crossed Ones, round one. Cool, complete side uh, relationship quests. At uh, one out of three. Okay, that's right. So now I'm gonna go with the main quest. And we're going to 
go to her class. Can I fast travel? Okay, let's start this one. It's good that you have to interact with it. What about the room, Professor? Oh my god, kids! I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. So cute. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Um, uh, hasn't he said anything? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streela. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Um, okay, uh, they mentioned that. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Um, okay. Um... What's this for? Um... I'm re just ready to go, honestly. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallo or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Um, okay. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallo is a capable young wizard. And he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavoury local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Okay, so I've got an assignment to do me, Professor. Um, okay, dokes. I've got to report to him, so let's do that. Um, okay, speak to Professor to receive your first assignment. Assignments are types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with the new spells. The reward for completing uh, your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Repair. Okay, cool. Which uh, is required to complete other quests. You can check. Okay, dokes, cool. So let's go grab that then. I don't know. Oh, he's actually out here. That's easy enough. Not the best it? idea. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The Mending Charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm, it seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Repero in no time. Okay, I'll complete the tasks. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Okay, dokie. Um, collect the flying page near the broken statue. Collect the flying page near the defense against stuff. Okay, we can do that. So I guess I this use is the right Got it. Rebellion. Wait, what is this? Can I use anything? Leviosa. 
Oh my gosh, that's what we do with these ones. Oh, I'll have to go back and get that other one then. Nice. Rebellion. Okay, where is this other page? A flying page must be around here somewhere. Where are you? Here you are. Brilliant. Sweet. Uh, I completed. Okay, report back to him. Awesome stuff. I trust the preliminary task. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, oh, your gosh, wand is a conduit tough. of your magic. Okay. I don't like the being chased. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, the mending. Okay, cool. So we can mend stuff like That's that. That's it. Awesome. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps another thought it too accurate and lashed out. Okay, um, so where is that? Oh, this one over here. Prepare it. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> awesome. Rebellion. Do I have to speak to him again? Or can I just, like, leave it now? I think I might just be able to leave it now. Quests, visit Hogsmeade. Um, okay. Uh, let's do this then. Professor Weasley has arranged to visit Hogsmeade. Okay. I adore Sounds good to me. Hmm. Oh, cool. The sirens? That's really cool. Cavellio. This I thought it possibly be as difficult as it seems. Okay, I'm curious about these mirrors. Hello, Lenora. What are you looking at? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Um, perhaps I'll have a look. Um, have you learned anything about it? Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Um, okay. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that Lewis. solves the mystery. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay, wait. So we've got... Okay, so that's there. So it's all like under the stairs with a statue thing. Under the stairs and... Here it is. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh, cool. We have to. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> like a little puzzle. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Yeah, and we can brag about it to her. <laughs> we can brag about it. Where is she? Okay, she's up here. I I'll quickly do this and then we'll go to Hogsmeade. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? Um... Followed clues? I found the location depicted in the painting and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. 
All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The okay. I should have seen that. Don't get so grumpy, will you? I have seen some other frames like that as well. Right now, we're going to head if I had to pick one, where we have to. What are you up to now? Well, fancy meeting you here. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Question is, do I get a mount? Please give me a mount. Oh, wow. Everyone's just spawning in. <laughs> I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. How did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. I mean, sure. I'll collect them all, I guess. <laughs> I like these. Okay, so I got three of them. If I got three of them out of all of them that were there, I got three. <laughs> Just three. I'm so gonna want to play this like all the Merlin's freaking time now. From the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Ah. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Are there supposed to be Obviously two of them? You see in the hippogriffs? Absolutely. Likely already made. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Oh yeah. That's actually pretty close. I still would really like to fly. Oh look, there's a train. Oh, there's a boathouse. Oh, can we go to Hagrid's hut if it's a thing here? Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? A little. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see. Places to discover. Oh, any you'd like to share with the class? Here. One day. I'm telling you all my secrets now. Yeah. You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Sorry, I saw. So <gasps> Cute! I can see these because I've seen death. That's sad, but also kind of cool. Okay, South Hogwarts region. Sorry, I'm just seeing stuff and I want to like pick it up. I want to interact with absolutely freaking like, everything. And I want my own like room in the room of requirements and stuff because that was stuff that they mentioned. There's so much. <laughs> so much. 
I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Sorry. Moonstones, nice. So he can see them as well. I wonder who he saw die. Sounds pretty bad when you say it like that, doesn't it? What's this way? I want to explore Mr. so much. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Okay. A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Oh, okay. Give me this butter bear. Give me it, give me it, give me it. Avelio. Honestly, there are so many padlocks. one could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. It's so cool. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Okay, sounds good. Remember, sounds have good. fun. It's Hogsmeade. Okay, Hosmead Village is bringing with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your Fields Guide map. Oh wow, it's actually kind of big. Um, shows shops and points of interest, which are the stars. You can track any of these, highlighting them. Okay, so I... Oh, there's chests. Wow, Fields Guide pages, that's 55. Demiguy statues, cool. Um, so where am I? I'm here. Tomes and scrolls. I guess I'll go here first then. Uh, visit tomes and scrolls. I did click on it. This one, please. Uh, okay, sorry, I pressed the rubbish pressing the wrong button. Uh, some quests have open objectives with no compass path. Uh, set a personal waypoint. Okay. Oh, it must be this blue one here. I love the fact that like the door looks like it's not something that you'd be able to actually go into, but you can. I love that. An inquiring mind. Rebellion. Oh, what is over here? Oh wow. Okay. Sorry, I'm just having a nose and then I will talk to you. <laughs> I promise. Oh, there's like a chest up here. What did I get? A sheepskin winter hat. Oh. Okay, cool. I love like plate this just looks so cool. Right, sorry, can I have my spells, please? Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. 
I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Okay, awesome. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Oh, cool. Beast feeder, spellcraft, temporary unveil. Oh, these look so cool. Okay, they are free of charge. That's good. It's a potting table and a small potion station. Oh, I have to hold it, sorry. If you're interested, feel free to take a look oh. around at the rest of my inventory. I can sell items, and some of the items give us, like, better... Um, Defense, offense, and stuff like that. So that's kind of cool. Defense. Okay, cool. So extraordinary. Maybe I have to be like a level five to wear that one. I think that that's what that means. Trace slot level. Cool. Yeah, there's a whole like sort of like enchanting your items type thing. And yeah, it's it's going to be exciting. <laughs> it's going to be exciting. Okay. Let's have a look around. Can I go in this place here? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. Um, oh, Ollivanders. Yes. See, look, it looks like it's like an NPC house that you just can't go into. But we should be able to go into it because it's Ollivanders. So cool! I do really do wish that we could go into first person, though. I'll be right with... Ah, it's <laughs> you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, I... About time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Hmm. Powerful core, ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Oh, that looks so cool! Well, if that's ahead, the one that swish. I got. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. No. Oh okay, maybe not. <laughs> well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. We'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, Ah, hmm, perhaps, yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Oh, that one looks cool, but unfortunately it's not that one. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Oh, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. 
I don't like the fact that all of the boxes he's picking out are the same yes. type of box. I think you might be the one. Here. Take it. Okay, cool. So, finalize the wand. Natural grey. Uh, so, yeah, we've got English oak, we've got phoenix feather, slightly yielding, 10 inches. So... It's, I mean, I can change the color of it. Natural gray. Curious indeed. Oh, I kind of really like this one. So you can have uni- Oh, dragon heart string. Does it matter? A dragon it, like, heart string wand is most it? powerful and learns quickly. Uh, self says the core of the wand known for producing consistent ah, magic. Phoenix feather. Exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Um, I mean, a great range of my. I'll just keep it as what I got when I did the when I did the thingy. We'll keep it. We'll keep it. What do you think? It's not the best looking ones, but you know what? It's what I got, so it's what I'm gonna. Extraordinary. <laughs> Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> I would have really liked like a fancy looking one. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Okay, sounds great. Right, so we got our wand. We need potions and stuff now as well. Um, Pokédex. Where are we going next? There was a point of interest, which is actually like this, which I wanted to do. And I need... So potions is over here. And then... I don't know where the other place was. My father always taught me to oh, it's a th the that weapon. place. Okay. Point of interest is in here first. Oh my Rebellion. god, it's so dark. I can speak to people in here. Oh no, I can just eat the muffins. <laughs> Yum. Oh my gosh, I could eat like a cupcake right now. I really want to like mount as well. I want to be able to fly. Such all this stuff. I think honestly. Oh, okay, cool. I got a hat. I think the only thing that I don't really like so much about this is the camera angle because it's sort of like only in Rebellion. one spot. I would really love a first person. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. Oh, can we go in here, please? <gasps> we can. Oh, sweet. Yeah, the camera angle is like the only thing that I'm not a huge fan of about this game. Are you okay there, kid? You were kind of shoving that in your eyeball. Put it back, put it back before you freaking... Oh cool, don't push. I like this place. Birdie bots every flavour beans. Oh my gosh, can I get a chocolate frog? Can I please get a chocolate frog? Oh cool. This is what I mean by the camera angles. It just seems so weird like this. Okay, can I get something? 
Oh my gosh, it like wraps the stuff. That's so cool. That is really cool. Can I buy something? I don't think I can, which is sad. Okay, I love that. I love that. I love that. Um, right. Let's see if we can find this potions place and the other one that we need to visit. Oh, honey jukes. Maybe this is where we'll get the chocolate box. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can. Oh my gosh, yes. Sorry. I still only mean this game is just gonna. I'm gonna there's gonna be so much. That's it, just still from the store. <laughs> Please tell me they have chocolate frogs. I don't see them. I think they're the body, uh, the birdie bots every flavor beans. And what are these? Exploding bonbons? Nice. Do I float? Oh, these are what we stole from that person's room. <laughs> what are these? I don't know what that is. I'm just gonna eat all these brownies. That looks so good. That looks so good. I'm gonna eat all of the candy before I try it. Oh my. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. So, so, so cool chocolate frogs what's over here elephant on a bicycle <laughs> oh there are these oh I love these in Harry Potter when they were eating them and I think it's Ron that goes into the lion oh that's cool I love those this is great this is so great can I take this in front of you yeah we're doing it. Okay. Um, okay, so that's locked. Okay, that's level locked too. Um, can I have a slice of cake? Okay, sorry. I gotta leave. I gotta leave before I get too sidetracked. <laughs> oh, we're so sidetracked. Okay, right, where am I? I'm super far away, so let's go to the potions thing. Um, yeah, let's go to the potions. Rebellion! Oh, here I've is a fast travel point faster. And what is this? We can just okay, um, a collection update. Nice. Let's go to potions. I'm going to spend so much time here. I don't believe it has a photo mode, but honestly a photo mode would be so freaking cool in this. Are you the potions guy? Welcome the to detail in this cushions. is honestly beautiful. Um, okay, blue four eye spectacles. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art, potion-making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and... I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, 
Let's get you those recipes, shall we? Okay, great. What can I do for you today? Um, okay, rest okay, healing potion, definitely. And then we have causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping to protect them from harm. That's cool. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Oh wow, these are a lot of money. Um increases drinker's spell damage for a limited time. Okay, cool. And then he also sells like components. Which is cool, and then he sells, uh, reduces the spell cooldown. Cool, and he has like healing ones. I, I, okay, I would sell, I mean I would buy a healing one, but I'm not going to at the moment. I forget how I use the healing one. Oh, I think it was um, G, wasn't it? I think it was G. I might have to try it at some point. Can I have a little look over here? Avelio. I love this, honestly. The detail is so freaking cool. <laughs> it's so cool, the whole game is just so cool. Right, we have one more place to go, which I believe is this place actually over here. It looks like the same. Uh, the magic. Okay, Handy here's another. Resource indeed, your field guide. Okay. Um, wait. Where'd you go? Oh, wow, look at that. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. Fluxweed, not grass, mallow sweet, um, shrivel fig. <laughs> okay, so we've got fertilizer, we've got lead. Okay, cool, awesome. Can I have a look inside? I love the look of this place. No, I can't. Okay. So I guess anyone with the like little coins above their head is a like a trader type thing. Okay. Let's go this way. See if we can see anything or pick anything up along our way. I'm so intrigued by like absolutely everything. Oh wait, there's something here. Oh cool, I got a casual school uniform. Nice. I'll probably change my clothes at some point. Can we get a butterbeer? I'm hoping that's where he is. Oh no, at the town circle. I mean, maybe we'll go and get a butterbeer. Can I go in here? We can. Um... Oh, is this like a barber place? Can I, I get to change my look? Okay, I'm probably going to come back here at some point. But for now, I'm happy with the hair I got. Yeah, I can't go in there. Sweet! Oh my gosh, look at that! It looks like a dodo. Oh, cool! I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Brood and Pet said a customer lost the deer cool round here. What is this? Yes. No? Okay. There you are. Huh. Finally. I'll have enough for that wind wisp. Ah. <laughs> well, not meant to be. Okay. 
open town another square. Adventure. Where is um? Let me have a look over here. Revelio. I really wanted to have a look in the like pub place. Oh, the three broomsticks is actually what it was called. We went in there. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Oh no. What the hell? Why, dude? Away from the building! Away from the building! But why? This place is so peaceful. Oh shit. Control. Okay, it's gonna be a dodgy one, isn't it? So it's control to dodge. Bring up. I forgot what it was to Literally repairing stuff in the middle of battle, that's cool. I think I'm supposed to like lob things at him. Okay. That was kind of painful, <laughs> not gonna lie. Uh, invoke ancient magic. Cool. Nice troll with the punches. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. 
Okay, cool. The voice sometimes really sounds like... Oh, cool. So I have like ancient... Um, oh, it really sounds there. like an AI. A, a moment if you would. I'll go and see what he wants. Um, sorry. I need Prepare. an arrow. Lucky they didn't do more was to like lock on to the target and I think the whole point of that one was the worst supposed to dodge like uh, you were supposed to dodge and you weren't supposed to try and freaking block it which is what I was doing Prepare. <laughs> Gotta repair this whole freaking building. Nice, cool. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Okay, um, awesome. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Oh, cool. I wish we could like... Oh, cool. We can preview them. Um, let's go back. What about this one? I kind of like that one. Oh, I like that one, actually. Temporary unavailable. Okay. I guess I'll, I'll, guess I'll just um get this one. <laughs> Um, okay, you received a new piece of gear. Time to equip it. Okay, dogs. Uh, your current defense and offense are displayed at the top right of the screen. Okay, cool. Uh, select cloaks and robes. Gear slot. Okay, cloaks and robes. Okay, so offense. Awesome. Oh, they're actually available now? Cool. No trait applied, so we can apply traits to them. I kind of really want one like this. I don't like that. This one's kind of cool. I mean, I'll probably definitely come back at some point. Oh, I like that one. I literally just have enough for it, though. No! No, I did not. I'm a freaking idiot. I just bought it. Can I sell it? Oh, I'm such an idiot. I can only sell it for like a half. What? Oh my gosh. Okay, that really sucks. Um, that one's not magical. I tell you what, I'm gonna sell this. I am a complete idiot, and I'm gonna sell the leather gloves because I don't want them. Uh, and the scarf. I'm gonna sell that. I can't believe I freaking stupidly bought that. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. I sell even more battle work. I don't care, honestly, dude. I'm beyond annoyed that I freaking stupidly bought this by accident. It's not what I wanted. It's really not what I wanted. I bought it by mistake. Oh my gosh, they look awful. 
Oh, they look awful. What am I? Freaking mad I moody now? I'll just stick with my bog standard ones, honestly. Oh, dude. I'm actually furious with myself. Oh, cool. I got some trousers. Should we put trousers on for a bit? Let's put some pants on. Um. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm furious at myself. Genuinely for buying that bag. So I was I trying to be spin. Inclined. You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Rebellion. I was trying to spin my character around so that I could see what the outfit looked like on her. But inevitably I actually ended up freaking buying the stupid thing which I shall is so annoying. But there we go. I bought it now so there's not really much I can do. <laughs> I could sell it, but I'll literally get like the a fraction Assuming of the price. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Give me no. some butterbeer. Okay. Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. It's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Sweet! Free butterbeer. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thank you for this. My pleasure. I will say... Trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> How timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Wanna bet? <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> Give me all the butterbeer. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. 
But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Yeah, sounds good to me. But first I must grab a bread roll. <laughs> Can we fly yet, please? I really. Oh my gosh, it's night time now already. Okay, uh, talk to us, Sebastian, outside three broomsticks. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Hollow. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Um, okay, you must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Okay, do we get to, like, fast travel? Select Hogwarts map. Um, okay, the Great Hall. Hufflepuff common room. Okay, cool. I wonder when we get a mount then. Right. Oh, the owl. Is that our owl? Did I choose an owl? Did I? Avelio. Okay, quest complete. I'm pretty sure this isn't the owl that I chose if I did choose one. Um. Right. Anyway, I'm going to eat this apple. And we're actually going to leave this video here because I have a feeling something's obviously going to happen. Um, you have received an owl. Okay, let's do this owl post first. Okay, come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found uh, at Gringotts. Okie dokes, awesome. So that's the only uh, thing that we have. Maybe we don't have any classes today. Um, but I will leave this video here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Honestly, I could get stuck in this game for hours <laughs> i think it's so good so far as i said the only thing that i'm not a huge fan of is the really really fixed camera angle um i wish that you could change it because sometimes it's hard to like have a look at things um but yeah sometimes her voice sounds a bit like an ai i mean it could very well be but it sounds very i don't know tinny but that aside I'm really, really enjoying this. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. Hit the like button, leave comments. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Bye.